quality of connection. So right now you need more jump. More jump to that stride. There, there. That's a nice canter. Okay, now leg yield off the left leg into the right rein. Think of even this leg. Yes, yes, don't you pull on that left rein. Good, good, good. Now circle, head it with your left hand. I know that's backwards. Shorten your rein. Head it with your left hand. Thank you. Now when you go to do your leg heel, you're gonna pet him with your left hand as you leg heel. Yeah, so now go my pet him, pet him, pet him. Oh my gosh, he didn't throw his head straight up in the air. Imagine that. Do you feel that? Again, so do the leg heel and pet him with your left hand as you leg heel. That's fine, you can take a circle. More jump, hands up, higher hands, leg on, more jump. There, that's a good canter. Right there, that's your canter. Now, start your leg heel, and now pet him with your left hand. Pet him, pet him, pet him. Oh my gosh, look at that. The pony didn't throw his head straight up in the air. You feel that? Look at that. Okay, trot rising, beautiful. Good. You can go ahead and take a break and fix your boot. Now, which frame has more contact? Okay, so fix that. Pet him with your left hand. There. And now left. So right when you pet him, you feel how he leaned in? So that means you were holding him straight with your left rein. There. Shorten your rein so you have contact on both sides. There. There. Left leg. Hands higher. Way higher. Way higher. Way higher. 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 Thank you. There. Now wider, there, and now pet it, only with the left, perfect, there, left leg, go crazy on it with your left leg, go crazy on it, yes, 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 pet it, right there, that was a give, good, good, go crazy on it again, yeah, there you go, there, pet him. You're getting him soft on the left. That's okay, keep trotting, I like it. Oops, wait, stay walking, I don't like it. There, off that left leg, off of my left leg, off. There, pet him, pet him. That's it, so see, that gets you to release the, that left arm. Left leg, left leg, left leg, go crazy, go crazy, go crazy, go crazy. Yes, keep trotting. There he, yes, there, and then pet him. Yeah, there it is. Good, shorten your reins, keep trying. That was great. Good, so you're gonna do that again. You're gonna go crazy on him with your left leg. There, and now pet him. Oh my gosh, look at that, perfect. Again, crazy on him with your left leg. Go crazy, go crazy, go crazy. Yes, and then pet him. Perfect, perfect. Go crazy, go crazy, go crazy. There you go. Nice. Now, do you feel how soft he is on the left rein? Yes. Yeah, that's amazing. Now your left arm isn't going to freaking kill you, right? I don't need your left arm to be twice as strong as your right. Left leg, left, go crazy on him, go crazy on him, go crazy on him with your left leg. There. Now pet him, pet him, because you're holding. Yes. That's it. Feel it? Nice. Nice. So look, Abby, look at Michaela's hands, how high they are. Do you see that? Your hands are several inches low. Look over right now. Do you see your hands? Okay, match that. Yes, yes, better, better. And then pet him. There, pet him, yes. And then left leg. Yeah, look at that, look at that. That's better hands, feel it? Yes, look up so that you're aware of what's going on. You have to be aware of, is he falling in? Is he staying on the track? Is he leaning, right? If you're always looking down at his head, you might know what's going on in his bridle, but you have no idea if he's falling in or out or pushing on the leg or staying on the track that you planned, right? And then again, same. Same here, that's a beautiful trot. Now, hands are left leg. Well done. Yes. Left leg, right leg. Right. Oh my gosh, look at that transition. Gorgeous. Now lift your hands as high as Michaela. Have a contest with Michaela right now. Who can have higher hands? <laughs> Michaela just bested you. Her hands just went up to her eyeballs. Look at her hands. Look at her hands. Yeah, thank you. There, and look how round her horse is. Yes, your 
pulling on my left brain. He said, go, go, go. Yeah, well, that was your fault. He told you for about 14 strides that he was going to break the trot, and you waited to react until he was at the trot. Yeah, right there, he's telling you again, isn't he? He's saying, I'm kind of tired. Don't pull, don't pull. Left hand pull. Yes, yes, I'm going to chop off your left arm. Left hand pull, left hand pull. There, there, there. Every time you want to pull in your left brain, push with your left leg instead. There, there. Now that's a beautiful canter. Good, ah, you're pulling. Don't pull, don't pull. Steer with your leg. Shorten your reins. If you feel like you're in your lap, go shorter in your reins. Nice, now quarter line leg, yield off the left leg. Quarter line, step. Yes, now do not pull on the left rein. Leg yield, pet him, pet him, pet him. Oh yes, that's correct. Gorgeous, do that again. Good, hands up, quarter line. Now pet him as you leg yield, pet him, pet him, pet him. Oh yes, that is correct. Leg on, leg on when you finish the leg yield. Now think about, ride a leg yield off the left leg even when you're going straight, just apply more right rein so he doesn't actually move over. So now down here, circle, and pretend like you're doing a leg yield off the left leg on the circle, even though you aren't. So you back it up with right rein so he doesn't actually move over, but ride leg yield with your left leg. Ride leg yield, ride leg yield. Do you feel that? So that is inside leg to outside rein connection. There, now do you feel how soft the pony is? Ride leg yield with your left leg into your right rein. Look at this, oh my gosh. She looks amazing today, Mabu. Frida? Uh, I was talking about Abby. I don't know. <laughs> but Frida looks great too. I, I've been working so hard on Abby, I haven't taken my eyes off of her though. Look at that, look at that. But look how soft he is on the I left brain. And the trot that you were getting earlier when I was talking to Leo, I was saying is super fluid in the hind. I know, because she's not jamming up on the left side. You feel that, Abby? This to me, it needs a little more jump, but at least it's supple. Yeah, do not pull, do not pull. Right leg yield off the left leg without being in a leg yield. Yeah. Look at that, and trot forward. Now in the trot, ride leg yield off the left leg without actually being in a leg yield. There, there, left leg kick, left leg spur, left leg spur. Look at that, that's a soft pony. Left leg spur. Yeah. Left leg spur. That jumped into my peripheral vision. Look at that. Abby, this is the best I've seen you going left. Left leg spur. Left leg spur. I think we just woke up your left leg for the first time. Change direction. This is great, Abby. Good. Forward trot. Nice. Nice. Now you still have to keep him off the left leg this direction, okay? All the time on this horse, it's about getting him off your left leg so that he stays light on the right. Okay, now you can go a little more forward in the trot. Think of just adding more spring without changing your hands. Go, go, go. Nice, right there, right there. That's a stunning trot. Let's go ahead and let him go stretchy trot, Abby. So really think through how you're going to get him to take a stretch. You're going to bring your hands wider. There you go. That is stunning. Good. What have we forgotten? Thank you. Left one. We might have forgotten our diagonal, but at least we're using our left one. Now look at that. Feel how soft he is? Does your left arm hurt? No. Is this the first time your left arm has ever not hurt after a dressage lesson? Potentially? Yes. <laughs> so I want you to memorize this feeling because you got him off of your leg and into your ring, okay? That's huge. Nice. Nice. More shot. More shot. And look how nice and free he's stretching. Good job.
You can go ahead and let him walk, Abby. That was fantastic. Back to trot. Good. Now look up. I want you to feel it, not look for it. Now, as you walk, push your left arm forward, left your head. Yes, perfect. See, right when you did that, you put your left spur on it. You might have not even known you did that, but that's the key. When you soften that left arm, all of a sudden you have freedom to use your left spur. That was great, Ab. Good job. <laughs> She's mad. That was good.
Okay. okay. I don't hate But this outline is better. Like she, when you were cantering before, she just looked stuck in her back. Now she looks free in her back. Like I think you're having to work harder at getting the pelvis where you want it. Yeah. But you had a good pelvis with no movement in her back. Okay. Now you have a good pelvis and you're, and you're maintaining movement in the back. Ooh, that's a good camera. And that's the first time her mouth has been closed on her left leaf this entire ride. Like, I'm not kidding. Yeah. Now her mouth is quiet. It's a little like Jack. Okay. Where it was like the second it's actually correct, wow, still has the mouth closed. And she's mad. I would set to the right. I just keep seeing that right shoulder pop out. There. There. It doesn't even have to be right flexion. Just push the shoulder in. Like shoulder four. Sorry, no one working here. But it's to me. Yeah. So then she gets softer on the left rein. To me, she wants to lean on that left rein more. And then pop the shoulder. And then pop the shoulder which is why both ways she was into the left rein in the camp transition. Because it's like Othello, she's escaping through the left to get out of the pressure. Nice. Nice. Something about her is her mouth was open again. Yeah. I'm not sure what yet. There. So then there, that's freer in the back again. Like you almost actually thought stretchy even though you didn't let her go down. Right. You thought stretch her back and she closed her mouth. I think it's with her back. I think when she tightens through like right underneath the saddle, is when she opens her mouth. I actually don't think it has anything to do with her head or her bend. Oh my God, see now that's really good. There, there, there. Nice to her back. So think whenever you want collection, keeping her back swinging. You don't want to work hard to hold the horse up for it. Like How do you think stuff? Michaela and I ride 10 a day? Because we don't let the horses kill us. We correct them. Jump on three. One, two, three. Keep going. Keep going. It's a bigger jump than Bomba. Oh, gosh. I think you didn't quite jump. You jumped like you're getting on Bomba. <laughs> Is your knee okay? What is? Not my knee. Oh, not your knee. I'm sore. I'm not funny. I didn't know horses had biceps. It's this. Oh. Oh, well, yeah, that makes I sense. That from the gallery. Yeah, yeah. We did. I love So I thought like, they'd be called hamstrings, but that makes Quinn, sense. If you sit here and do this. Yeah. Oh, she loves um, that. Thing. Which one? Oh, the pecs. If you just, like, massage their pecs. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at him. Oh, he oh, likes oh, it. Oh, no. He's like, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that feels good. He likes good. it. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. That's great. You want to do a little bit? Try, Abby. Why don't you just pick up your reins and practice the same idea of getting your hands up, have the contest you did with Michaela. Now you can do a contest with Charlotte. Uh, whose hand can be higher? And if you have to vomit, halt first. Yeah, and just off to the side so it's not on the tack. <laughs> oh, I've got a lot more cleaning to do then. Yeah. There you go. Right. Up, and now use your left leg. Come on. Oh, yeah. Left leg. Left leg. Left leg. There. There. See when you put your leg on, you then don't have to pull? Push. Push. There, left leg, do not pull. Do not pull. So, so see, you can do your special. Sam's almost here to grab him and then we'll get started. Left leg. So now you're not pulling, 
time bending her off your left ring, you're bending her off your left leg. Imagine that. Nice. Bend her from your left leg. Yeah. Better. Yeah. For the next month, I'm going to make you do that a lot so you get used to not pulling on the left ring. Go around the ring. They want to come in. Okay. 
You're pretty much done, Abby. This looks amazing. 